Hey everyone, this is the KYGNE Wi-Fi Smart Plug that works with Alexa. So we're gonna open up the box here and inside you have an instruction manual and the actual smart plug and that's all that you got in there. So we're gonna go ahead and plug the smart plug in. The second we plug it in, you start seeing that it's searching for Wi-Fi. We're gonna grab the manual here and see what it says for us to do. The first thing it wants us to do is to take a picture of this QR code with our phone, or you can actually just search for Smart Life in the Apple Store or Google Play, so you can install the app. Now, I've actually already installed the app on my phone here, so the first thing we need to do is add the device. So it's gonna search for the device, and you're gonna tell it what kind of device it is. It's an electrical outlet. It wants to confirm that it's blinking rapidly. So we'll confirm that. It's gonna ask us to enter the Wi-Fi password. So I'm gonna type in my password. Confirm it. And now it's searching for it. I just heard it click on and off. As you see, the light has stopped flashing over here. It's still trying to connect to it. We're about a quarter of the way done. While we're waiting, I'm just gonna go ahead and plug my lamp into this outlet so that we're ready to go and we start getting to the next step. So as you see, it's on. It's still not being controlled by the smart plug because we're still connecting to it. There's a button here on the side which does let me manually turn it on and off. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave it off right now. It's showing that we are 50% done. Oh, it just went up to 60% and my screen timed out. So we're at 80%, so it looks like the second half goes a lot faster than the first half. There we go, successfully added to one device, mini smart socket. Hit done. There's a picture of a socket. If I click it, I can turn it on and off, just like the button here on the side. It gives you options to add a schedule so you can tell it what time you want to turn it on and off. There's a timer schedule for how long you want something to be on for. You can make it random. So for when you're out of town, you can have it come on and off randomly during different times and days. And then circulate, which gives you, you set your times, your duration on and duration off. So it's a lot of options just here within the software itself. And then you can actually want to use Echo, which is what I want to do. So I'm going to rename this Light. Confirm it. Go to Use Echo. And it's saying add the device modify the device name, which is what we just did, and then go to alexa.amazon.com and add the skill. So I've already opened up alexa.amazon.com and I've searched for the skill called Smart Life. So I'm just gonna choose it here, and then I'm gonna enable it. And it's gonna ask me to log in so I've logged in. It now says to continue, close this window to discover devices you can tr control with your Alexa. So we're going to close that window and go back into where we've enabled it. And now it says discover devices. Alexa is looking for devices. So we'll wait for this to go through. Almost done.
It says it's found two. So I think we're good to go. I'm now going to tell Alexa to turn on the light. Turn on light. Okay. And there you go. The light is on. Tell Alexa to turn off the light. Turn off light. Okay. So Alexa has full control of this device now. I can still manually turn it on and turn it off with the button here on the side. And you know that Alexa is going to be talking to it as long as you see that the Wi-Fi light is lit up. So this is connected to your home system. It didn't need a hub or anything like that. It just went right into the Wi-Fi, logged in with the software. And then I just went to the Alexa software and had it discover the device after adding the skill. So once again, this is the KYGNE Wi-Fi smart plug that works with Alexa.